And now it's time for The Catch, which takes you around the Great Lakes to hear from reporters about the issues they're covering. Stacy Drulard is a new contributor to GreatLakesNow.org, where she'll be exploring indigenous issues in her column, Nibi Chronicles. Nibi is the Ojibwe word for water. I thought it was a natural title for a column about the Great Lakes and specifically where I live here on the North Shore of Lake Superior. Based in Grand Marais, Minnesota, Stacy is a Grand Portage Ojibwe direct descendant, and her father is a band member. Stacy says she hopes to infuse Nabi Chronicles with ideas rooted in the interconnections that are a crucial part of how she views the natural world. The Ojibwe way, the Anishinaabe way, um, is a very holistic way of looking at the world. Everything's connected, and that includes other cultures, other people, um, and certainly other bodies of water. And there's a lot to be learned, I think, um, from uh, Ojibwe history and culture. Um, and so hopefully people will tune in to that. Stacy's column will be a monthly feature consisting of shorter written pieces and photos, like the ones she took at this year's Water is Life Festival in Duluth, Minnesota. I thought it was just a, a great, um, beautiful event and experience to be a part of, and I wanted to share it. I think what um, we'll be exploring as we move forward with the column is um, things that I find inspiring, and I hope that um, the topics that I write about and explore are relevant to others. At Great Lakes Now, we aim to cover the Great Lakes region and the people who live here, like you. Please follow us on social media, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and sign up for our newsletter at greatlakesnow.org.